How to upgrade Windows 11 from 32-bit to 64-bit In this video, I will show you how can you easily upgrade your Windows 11 from 32-bit to 64 without losing any data. So without any delay, let's get into it. For that, firstly you need to head towards setting and go to the about section of your laptop or PC. There, you need to check whether your computer device is based upon 34-bit or not. After you have checked that, simply back up your data. So you can even use any third-party software to back up your data. Once both the steps are completed, then after you can start upgrading Windows 11 from 32-bit to 64-bit. So the very first step is to download the official tool to create Windows 10 installation media. After running the tool, set the option and make it download the 64-bit system file of Windows. After that, in the setup page, choose the language in which you want to install. Once the install is completed, the tool will automatically process the creation of the USB flash type to install OS. Then restart the computer, enter the BIOS and select the boot for the USB flash type. After that, in the next step of Windows setup, you will see the option of key. So click on install now and then click on active windows. By clicking I don't have a product key because the operating system will be automatically activated later. In the next page, you need to select the operating system which is in the same edition but is of 64 architecture. Once you have chosen, you need to choose the option of custom install windows only advanced option. After that, select the multiple partition of current system device and click delete one by one. Then reselect the hard disk and drive and then click on next to continue. After the installation is completed on demand, the system is automatically activated. You may need to reach out to the PC manufacturer for instruction for update drivers and hard drive compatibility. So that's all. That is how easily you can upgrade your Windows 11 from 32-bit to 64-bit without losing any data. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for such tutorial. Thank you for watching till the end.